Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I've got a fun little tutorial for you where I'm going to show you how you can create digital stickers using the iPad Notes app. So let's get straight into it. So the process that I'm going to show you can be done using the Notes app and also by using Quick Notes, which is saved to the Notes app. So we're going to do the Quick Notes version first and then I'll show you how to use it in the actual Notes app afterwards. So let's go ahead and create a quick note. So to create a quick note, you want to swipe from the bottom right hand corner. You'll then see we have this little pen tool just here. So we're going to tap that and it will open the toolbar. So you'll see you have a few different options here, different pens, highlighters, an eraser, a lasso tool. Here we have the color palette. So you can either have it on the grid, you can change the opacity of the color spectrum or you can slide and you can even put in your hex code here if you know what color it is you want to use okay so the tool that i'm going to use today is actually the crayon i think that one's my favorite at the moment so we're going to put the opacity up a little bit and we're going to go for pink again okay so let's create a cute little floral i just love the texture of this it looks so nice And then we're gonna go for go for an orangey center. And I think I'm going to make the brush size a little smaller so you can change the brush size just here. Okay, so I'm happy with that. So what we're going to now do is you wanna hold down at the top and you just wanna slide it to the side and you'll see that it creates a little tab here. When you tap that, it's gonna pop back out. If you wanted to close the note completely, what you would do is just tap done and it will go. And then you can swipe back up and it will bring it back up. But I personally like to just swipe it to the side when I'm gonna be going into the GoodNotes app. Okay, so let's tap into GoodNotes. And then we wanna tap back on the little arrow at the side. Now to drag this into our planner, what we're going to do is hold down until it's highlighted, then hold down again and drag. And now I'm going to tap done here because we are finished with that. And you are then able to move this around. You can crop it if you want to make it a bit smaller. And you can resize it and place it wherever you want it to go within the planner. I think it's a really nice way to be able to add a little bit more fun and colour to your planner. Okay, so if we were doing the same thing but directly in the Notes app, what we would do is tap the Notes app, tap the pen icon again, then you've got your toolbar here at the bottom. And then you can create whatever design you want. Once it's complete, you want to tap the three dots at the top, split view, head back to your digital planner in GoodNotes. You can then even grab the lasso tool, isolate the picture, hold down, and then you can drag and drop it straight into your planner. Then we can close this, and again, resize that to whatever size you want it to be, and place it wherever you want it to go. So an obstacle you might run into when you're trying to drag this into here is when you're putting your finger down, if instead of highlighting, it is just adding more pen to the actual note, what you want to do is head to your settings, tap on Apple Pencil, and then you want to make sure that this setting here is on. So you only want to draw with the Apple Pencil. And that way, when you put your fingers onto the screen to drag and drop the image, it's not going to add more pen. It will allow you to highlight it and drag and drop it straight into the digital planner. So I think these look really, really cute. And you know, you don't need to download Procreate. You don't need to have Adobe Illustrator to create just these fun, quick little doodles. Obviously, if you did want to start creating digital art that was a little bit more detailed, I would recommend then downloading something like Procreate where you have a lot more options. But if you're just looking to create fun little decorations, the Notes app is fine. 
Okay friends, so I'm going to wrap this video up here. Let me know in the comments if you found this video helpful and if you'd like to see more videos like this in the future, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.